I don't want to be late, but I do need to go to the bathroom. Primarily to fix my hair. Look at this shit. Better, right? Hello and welcome to the first Reddit recap of 2022, that of course being for January, with my almost 90,000 members submitting stuff and upvoting the best stuff, we're sure to find some great things. <laughs> Look how happy Matto is. I mean, this is really good, but I wish you didn't do that. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember this trip. Honestly though, I think I would enjoy going to the Rockstar offices, even if uh, that was on the building. Wait, is, is this meant to be Red Dead 1? How old is this? No, it is, Arthur? It doesn't look like it. May I need to play that game again so I can recognize the main character. It do be like that, though. How to get karma on our Dark Viper AU. Get a funny face screenshot. Make sure there is a random word in chat. Make it into a crappy meme. Me when your mum. You when. When your mum. Banana. Post it on Reddit. Wait for comments. Yeah, in, in, indeed, those people are typing banana over and over again. Profit. Definitely getting some 55k karma doing that. This is awful. Very good. Bought the Wired Matto mug. Best $20 ever spent. <laughs> he widens the wide mug. <laughs> and your blinds look like cheese. Very good. If you too want a Wired Matto mug, you can buy it at my merch store which has like all my emotes as well as my face on every item you can imagine. As long as your imagination is limited to tank tops, hoodies, shirts, mouse pads, phone cases, and stickers. As long as that's the limit of your imagination, it's on everything you can imagine. This happens too often. I find a plane. I fly the plane. I crash the plane. I died. I was spawned at the hospital, so I'm closer to the mission. I spawned at Mount Chiliad because the spawns are randomized. That did happen more times than it really should have during the randomizer series. Because you forget, like you just, you spend 9,000 hours spawning at the hospital. Even if you know it's random, you still forget, all right? It's normally a legitimate strategy. POV, you got kidnapped. POV, you are kidnapped after saying Michael is in witness protection. <laughs> that face is so terrible. I mean, you'd be lucky if the person who kidnapped you was willing to make you a cake. I'm just saying. Just saying. This is awful. Griefer Viper EU. This is really bad. Like, this isn't like me joking that this is This is just... Uh, I do think I should be a religious figure. Come on, Matt. You know you want to. GTA 5's most chaotic mod has come to Red Dead Redemption 2. But that's just... It's just a terrible idea. Like, any effect would immediately fail the mission. Did they also reprogram the game to allow for any form of variation outside of Rockstar's very strict script? Like a bunny rabbit spawns. Mission failed! There's a bunny rabbit in the road! Maybe one day, chat. I don't know, maybe it would make the game more enjoyable to go through. Considering Chaos elongates GTA 5 by, like, what? Three or four times. Elongating... Red Dead 2, it would take, what, like, 200, 250 hours? Dude, no. <laughs> A dream comes true. I'm bored in bed. My laptop is fully charged. Matto goes live. Matto is in a good mood. A rare thing. I win a round of marbles. Matto opens GTA. Matto starts to speedrun. Matto has good RNG. Matto stops looking at chat to concentrate. Matto sets a new 100% world record. Okay, now, you, now you've moved into dream territory. I'm bored in bed. I think you've just fallen asleep, my guy. <laughs> I think this is just the dream. Oh. Chillest chat ever. This is probably the least toxic chat I have ever seen. Neat. Carbine responds. Fuck you. Ratty. Fuck you. <laughs> Sock my socks. <laughs> I do actually remember that message. This must be very... Wait, what? 21 days ago. Okay, after some examination, I've banned this person. Oh! Oh! This didn't happen 21 days ago. This is from a YouTube video of a really, really old run. This person was banned in 2019. Their last message was 2019. How do I remember this message? I think I must just had like another person say something very similar recently. Oh my god! Oh my god! A person must have seen this message and come into my stream recently and repeated the exact same message. 
And I responded to that message, so I remember the copycat's message. It's all coming together. Congrats, Matto. Congrats on the happy news, Matto. They replaced the HyperX <laughs> storage thing with a pregnancy test. Very good. This reminds me of those various images of like conversations where a person's like, Honey, I've got positive results. And they show like a, a pregnancy test and the person's like, Oh my God, you have COVID? <laughs> I guess you have to isolate. <laughs> Whatever. Because <laughs> a COVID test looks somewhat like a pregnancy test. Funny. Internet funny. Dodge the bullet. Welcome to heaven. To enter, you must be forgiven by everyone you killed. Well, I never killed anyone, so... Video games included. Matt, who is a pacifist. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I've never killed anyone in a, in a video game. As I always say, I just happened to be around when people died. Wasn't my fault. Takes a shortcut through alley. When I remember a few strats from Matt's videos and try them out myself, you know I'm something of a speedrunner myself. Yeah, I've done this as well with other people's runs as well. Mainly Dark Souls and stuff, before I started speedrunning. And it's a fun feeling, it's like, oh I know this thing, I can do this like that other guy. It's very good. Couldn't help but notice an oddly familiar place in Transformers. <laughs> I wonder how many movies this building has been in. I guess because there's so much shooting in Los Angeles or whatever, that it, I mean, it's the observatory, so I guess that makes sense. It's weird that I've been to an observatory so much, but I have no idea what's inside of it. POV, you're visiting the observatory. Tourists visiting the Galileo Observatory and seeing a man jump out of a blimp. I went, oh, the fuck was that? <laughs> Hello? There would be quite the video though, reenacting the blimp strat in real life and I just get like a parachute or some shit and land in the observatory. I'd die though, so no, not gonna do it, but still. School computer wallpaper. <laughs> like I'd be creeped out if I just walked into, not just me personally, just like if I was just a random person walking into a computer lab in a school and just seeing <laughs> that is the, the background. It's like, how you doing? What you doing there? <laughs> You've heard of Michael is in witness protection, now get ready for Lester is Brad? Dude, I've heard this many times, and it's so impressively dumb. Think about it, look closely at Brad in the prologue, see that little limp in his right leg, now compare it to Lester's limp. Because they look somewhat similar, but I mean, nine years does not do that to a man. But also, if you listen to any of the dialogue in the game, like literally any of it, no. It's not even worth debunking, you need to watch the cutscenes. Like there's literally a scene where Lester's talking about their past and Trevor interjects that Brad was with us sometimes. And Lester's like, oh yeah, Brad, he was there with us sometimes too. <laughs> like, like Brad in prologue, but that's deleted dialogue, literally references Lester not being there. Meso GTA SA speedrun. He was never actually in witness protection. Carl! Dang, where are you up? Where you running off to, Carl? Uh, geez, you nearly got me there! Ow. It's ingenuous, dense motherfucker! Come on over here, son. So fucking mad. Own you. You're out. What? In what reality would anyone interpret that I was claiming that Mudahar controls Twitch? That Mudahar is sucking the dick of everyone at Twitch and controls the code? He cannot be sincere! Hey, you. Yeah, you. Matthew Judge, <laughs> aka Dark Viper AU. You disingenuous, dense motherfucker! You have to know something about something, or you couldn't tie your fucking <laughs> shoes! You just killed him! At a funeral? What the fuck was. That is some. Like, it's a massive fever dream. <laughs> Chopper's looking as confused as I am. Uh, thank you for making whatever that was. <laughs> Meanwhile, in a different universe, Green for Jesus playing chaos, turn ocean into wine. Romans attack you, walk on water, become Green for Jesus. Matto, take the wheel. Oh, come on, chat. Now it's going to take forever to get to that mission. Hey! The implication being that I'm shit at driving. Sorry for bad editing. Dark Viper AU, when he. This isn't a meme. I just wanted to tell Matto that he should check out the Watch Dogs Legion Bloodline DLC. It's much better than the main game. It's more story focused and it has Aiden Pierce as the protagonist again. And since he said Watch Dogs 1 is his favorite of the bunch, I think he'd enjoy playing it. These bloody Ubisoft PR people coming into my Reddit trying to get me to play their games. I see your tricks, Ubisoft. I see them. 
Maybe I would enjoy doing that, honestly. Maybe I would. But the reason why I've had time to uh, play single player games is because like I, I took a break from no damage and I wasn't doing speedrunning. Now I'm back doing speedrunning. The time where I would be playing single player games, I'm speedrunning. Hey chat, my name is Matthew Judge and welcome to my crib. <laughs> the funny thing about this picture is you've put these assets in your game. Like you didn't edit those pictures there. Those pictures are in your GTA 5. And I'm gonna accuse you right now. I don't think you looked for those pictures for this meme. I think you had them already. Lollies are gross, chat. And this is sus as fuck. Welcome back, Maddo. I love seeing people smile at their phones in public. Have they received happy news? Is it a text from a loved one, perhaps? What could be instilling such joy in that moment? As <laughs> me going back to speedrunning. I'm so happy to be back. I wish I had more energy to do more runs. It's nice learning all the strats again. Even though I am so much worse than I used to be. Matto apparently doesn't understand what an undo button does. And I guess that's what the joke is, because, like, so if, if you slow this down, at least for my ears... Okay, well, I, I pressed the hotkey to save the post, apparently. Can I just, uh... Oh, no. Uh, okay. I was just trying to slow down the video. Oh! oh. Uh, stop. Stop. Stop it. Go away! There's too many of them! Reddit, please. Can you... Can you stop, please? Hello? I impressed it that many times! Oh my god. It's still going... <laughs> I look so dejected. It's fine. We'll leave it there. <laughs> I just give up. <laughs> so I didn't realize it was saying post unsaved successfully. And then when you undo that, it then comes up and says post save successfully. I didn't see the un. So I thought it was just, ki I just thought it was continuously coming up saying post unsaved successfully. Not realizing that I was merely all same backwards and forwards between saved and unsaved by continuously, continually hitting undo. That is really funny, but I wish hadn't called me out for my stupidity. Fuck you. <laughs> that was very good. Thank you. My store was selling a boxed measurement of time. <laughs> Why is it called a jiffy? I guess they're saying you can make corn muffin mix in a jiffy? Did you know a jiffy is a box of corn muffin mix? It's true. Comfort is secondary. Matto bring a girl home be like. Whose house is this? It's just some dude's house? I mean, it, it is as empty as my house, sure. This is not my house, I don't have floor like that. I know what my house looks like. Oh, the boxes are meant to be furniture. As if that's like a couch. Oh. Man, dude, I hope you get a couch one day, man. I don't have a couch either. Sorry for bad quality. You will never be forgiven. <laughs> it's actually really bad quality. I get it's meant to be me returning to speedrunning the return of the king. Thank you. There aren't cheaters in missions. Because normally I duck behind the tree. But this car, I can do the exact same thing I just did there. To give myself perfect cover. To kill these bikers. <laughs> what? What? There aren't cheaters in missions! <laughs> I heard it, but there aren't cheaters in missions! This is millions to one! This is actually me. I have been playing this game for 8,000 hours! I have never seen a car kill someone in a mission before! <laughs> I haven't even seen a car in this area, in a mission! Very good. <laughs> you put a lot of effort into that. Thank you so much. Wait, is this... Is this my character model from online? Or is it just me? It looks like both, honestly, because my character model in online kind of looks like me. Matto likes chairs. Matto in strip clubs. This is brilliant, but I like this. If you don't get the reference, it's somewhere back there in my content. I'm just saying, chairs are nice, and that is a nice chair. Like, you're walking around, and your feet hurt, and you're just like, Oh, a strip club, great, there's someone to sit down. Because <laughs> they don't charge you any money. When you get in there, the drinks are just overpriced. And they assume you're going to give money to the women or whatever. And I was like, nah, I get to sit down. Don't get me wrong. The women are attractive, of course. But the seats, after you've been walking around for an entire night, 
fucking amazing. First post here, please be gentle. Me explaining to my mum why a fictional character wasn't in witness protection. I really like the meme, it's really cute. Awful news. YouTube thumbnails be like, we broke up. This is awful. And it's not very good. Where, where do these come from, these eyes? I've seen them multiple places now and it always looks disgusting. This isn't some guy crying. This is some guy with a severe medical issue. Dark Viper AU when he lays down. These are background noises from GTA. He went for a different head. <laughs> I see, I see where you're going with this now. <laughs> it's a Twitter 4 iPad joke. You got some nice Photoshop skills there. I guess this is how people edit on their phones. That's wild to me, wild. See more buds. Dark Viper AU, Rainbow Miser, Chaos, Speedrun, Speedrun with Snow Mod. It's coming, all right? I just have to learn all the speedrun again so I can do full runs. And we're done with the first segment, so we're moving on to the next segment. I cry every time. Matto taking off in a plane. Name something more frustrating. Oh wait, I do succeed sometimes. And because I fail so much, it is really rewarding when I do succeed. It's funny though, it is possible to make it so planes don't spawn on the roads in Rainbow Miser, or specifically now Rainbow Miser Chaos, and I did a poll on stream and everyone voted to keep the planes in. You guys complain, but you totally like seeing me try, is what I'm saying. Matto assuming that every vehicle form online has a boost button, but they do! It's like 90% of them! And if they don't have a boost button, they have like a reality warp drive or some shit. Just GT Online's basically Star Trek. My class teacher recently allowed me to print out memes to hang up at the back of class. Look at the third pic from the left. <laughs> this is just a random picture of me looking angry <laughs> next to Linus Tech Tips. I'm on the wall now, chat. I'm there with the greats, like The Rock. And this guy. <laughs> the honor. Thank you. Someone messaged me and they were like, hey man, you're a GIF now, on Twitter. There's a bunch of GIFs of me. I love this one. <laughs> me looking for who asked. <laughs> How do they get here? Do people like add them to Twitter or something? That's a great GIF though. Rockstar moment. 13 year olds after buying a GTA mod menu for $7. I'm gonna ruin you. Every one of you. I got your names. I got your addresses. I know where you live. <laughs> Hey, good dude. The ultimate proof that Masso is Freddie Mercury. I love this thumbnail. It is the best thumbnail I've ever made, and it sucks that episode two had a better thumbnail than episode one. But I thought this was inspired. It was, it was actually hard to make because like I upscaled the original 100% achievement, but it didn't really come out well, so I basically had to remake it. The coloring is good. It, it just looks so perfect. My face looks kind of weird, but you know. Like 90% of vehicles have this color. Randomizer is able to color cars any color on the spectrum. Also randomizer. I don't think that's true. There were heaps of car colors in the series. Do you guys just hate this color? These aren't even the same color. Like this is darker green, this is lighter green. These, are, these ones have pink. It's always green. I don't know, chat. I don't know about that. Dark Viper AU daydreaming into his happy place. Chair. <laughs> Shit, here we go again. Actually, I don't see any chairs. Okay, well, I see a few chairs. <laughs> it's just thumbs down, dogger. Please be more Australian. Call someone a disingenuous, dense motherfucker and nobody bats an eye. Use the C word and everybody loses their minds. It is weird. It doesn't make any sense. I don't want my past first episode with Trevor saying the C word to be age-gated and demonetized. It's not cool. Took him years to do it. 
Like I'm tempted to cut out that section so I can have it remonetized and not age gated. But it's such a good joke. And it's been there for a long time. Maybe I should just remove it. And then when YouTube comes to their senses, probably a few years down the line, I can just put it back. Someone at my gym drives the vehicle from Repossession Mission and has the Rockstar logo on it. Oh wow, it does really. Or did you put that there? Kowalski, enhance. I don't know, man. This could have been drawn with a Sharpie or something. Like, why would a person put it like that, distorted like that? I don't know, man. Media share videos be like. I thought it was going to make a joke that it will cut away too early and we won't see the cool thing. <laughs> I didn't see the recoil coming. That is uh, <laughs> very funny, dude. Very good. I was trying to do the buffer ledge grab trick and, well, let's just say it's minions to one. <laughs> I did hear it. A little growl before. It happens, dude. One in a million, but it does happen. You got very unlucky, man. My wife told me I shouldn't post this, so I'm posting it. Also, she got me the mug for Christmas. <laughs> oh my god, you're putting vanilla Coke! No! Coke would be fine, but not vanilla Coke. Because it's the doggo drinking Pepsi Max. But I also really hate vanilla Coke. Vanilla Coke is terrible. Nah, I'm kidding. You can drink whatever you want. You can be wrong in what you drink, it's, it's totally alright. But thank you for buying one of my mugs. And so that's it for this episode, thank you everyone for watching. If you want to join my subreddit, I'd really appreciate that. We're almost at 90,000 members. Thank you to everyone who submitted stuff, regardless of whether or not you got in the Reddit recap. Remember there's always the catch up Reddit recap, so you might get into that if you didn't get yours in this episode. Be sure to upvote all the best stuff for next episode, and uh, I hope you're all doing good.